Clutches out their away, a few wheelies as they pull away. But the Kawasaki hits the front, so Reynolds, but Reimer there, slipping through. So Terry Reimer into the right-hander. Feeling their way round. Number seven, Terry Reimer, flanked by a brace of Nortons. Trevor Nation, number five, was on the grass. But Terry is already pulling out quite a gap. It'll be interesting to see if the power of the Norton has any answer for this. But it's Steve Spray in second, Trevor Nation in third. In fourth place, it's number two, Brian Morrison. Uh, Brian Morrison, the pole position setter, he's uh, certainly on his way, and I'm sure he's going to be catching Steve Spray shortly. Terry Reimer at this point will be getting pit signals. He should now be well aware that he's two and a half seconds in front, so he can afford to slacken the pace just a fraction. Second place, but the power of the Norton came into play there. Spray was away. This is the race leader again, number seven, Terry Reimer, Steve Spray and Brian Morrison. A look over the shoulder for Morrison because he suspects that Spray's teammate, Trevor Nation, is in his wheel tracks. But Morrison really going well through up to second place, number two, Brian Morrison. In third place, it is still the norm of Steve Spray, number 20. Trevor Nation, his teammate, is in fourth. And Steve Chambers, number six, still in fifth on the Honda. So. Yamaha leads Honda, Morrison hard on the front brake, the knee goes out, looking very, very closely at the rear end of Terry Reimer, but Ian Duffus ahead of them, so also from Kokodi, Ian Duffus won't be wanting to get in the way of Brian Morrison. This is made, it caused Terry a major problem there, and Terry will be very wary of these back markers, quite sensibly too, he was, uh, he ran into a back marker at Donington Park three weeks ago when he broke his wrist, so, oh, that was a problem for him there, but uh, he'll be picking his line, the problem with back markers is, and he's